fellow Sudokans, and welcome to Zen and the Art of the Guardian Sudoku Puzzle. It's Monday the 31st of October 2022. Halloween. Hello all. Uh, it's time for the ghosties and ghoulies to be out because it's almost 11 p.m. here. I'm actually supposed to get up in the morning as well to work. And uh, so uh, I should get on with this game. Now, I was thinking that um, I've recently I've been playing the um, Los Angeles Times hard level uh, quite often as my supplementary game, a, a, a Sudoku at bedtime. But in the past, I've played various games and tried to mix it up a bit in terms of level, uh, going up to the Ducks hard level game, which is a proper expert level game, and then down to some of the easier level games as well. Uh, and I was thinking that I've been neglecting the medium levels. Um, so uh, there are people who like all kinds of levels on the channel. I know that the commenters usually are the experts and they prefer the harder level games, but uh, actually uh, we have to um, cater to everybody. Well, we should try to cater to everybody, shouldn't we? So let's get on with the... Uh, uh, the, today's uh, New York Times medium level Sudoku, but be warned, I have certainly played this in the past on the channel quite a few times, and it has sometimes proved to be a really tough game as well, so uh, actually it may not turn out to be a medium level, it may turn out to be trickier than that. I'm going to jump in and tell you what I can see because it's getting late, and I don't want to be carried off by any ghosties or ghoulies. <laughs> Uh, I can see fours blocking up, up and across, so that's going to give me a four there. <coughs> Excuse me. Okay. There are threes blocking across these two rows here. That puts a three into that square. There are fives across these two rows with a five down here. That puts five there. Five going up this column and up this column, five here. Okay, we have six and seven and six and seven in these two columns, so we'll block down here, and that means these two squares must be six or seven only. And knowing that, what does it mean? Uh, six or seven, so we're looking for um, uh, six or seven, so we're looking for two. Three, uh, threes I know already. Two, three, and f four. This is six or seven, isn't it? Yeah. So we've got the four blocking down here and four across here. So four goes in that square. And the three blocking across here. So that puts the three into this square here. Uh, now three blocking down here, three is in one of these two squares here, blocking downwards, three across these two rows, so three in there. Also three up here, three down here, three there. Uh, now I must be able to get this, must not I, because this is six or seven, so this has to be a two. Up here we're missing 1 and 9, uh, so here is 2 and 8, and here is 2 and 8 as well, so 2 blocking across here, there's the 2, and that's the space for the 8. Uh, 
4 and 9 block this square here. We're looking for 1, 4 and 9 in these three squares, so that's got to be our 1 now. I can hear someone calling. I'm not sure if they're calling for their pet or calling for their mother. <laughs> it sounds quite strange. Okay, down here we have 2 and 6, because 2 and 6 block across these two rows here. So this is a pair of 2 and 6. Does it help me? Uh, down, well, back across this row, that means that we are looking here for 3 and 8. So yes, we have the 3 blocking down there. That's the space for the 3, that's the space, space, space for the 8. <laughs> uh, 8 blocking down here and across these two rows here so that puts an 8 into that square there mm -hmm. that's going to give me 8s like that Okay, let's stretch my eyes around the board a bit. Now I was looking before at the uh, 2 and 6 that I had here. I didn't investigate this block fully, I just started to work out these. So I now see that we have 3's blocking across here, and 3 up here and 3 down there. So that's the location for 3. So once again, this is 6 or 2. Uh, can we say anything about 1s? No. 4s? Uh, no, not really. 5s? Yes. Um, because the 5 blocks across here and the 5 blocks up there. So that must be the location for 5. And now we have 5 up and up and across and across. So the 5 is there. <coughs> And that was the final uh, digit 5, by the way. Now back here, 6 and 2. Uh, anything else that I know now? Well, yeah, I like the 7s put in those squares. That means 7 will be in those two squares. 7s are up there. Down here we don't really know. Uh, right, back to Earth. Um, okay. Like I say, these medium games from the New York Times are not exactly a pushover. Um, not like, say, the Guardian medium level games, which are often, which can often be done without any any real thought. Um, okay, I have noticed that fours have to appear in these two squares.
Maybe I should start clicking through the digits to have a closer look. Um, what do I know about ones? Well, I know they're somewhere along there. I know they're here and they're here and they're here and they're somewhere up there. And over here, I have no idea. So ones are a bit tricky over on this side. Let's see about the twos. We know twos are there. We know twos are here, up there, down here. Um, but unfortunately down here, quite a few places and then up here, no restrictions, right? So that's too tough. Three is done, four. Fours are here. Uh, fours are like this, fours are up here. Sixes. Sixes are where the twos are. Okay, so this is a pair of six and two, actually, six and two down here now. So sixes go up there, but down here, six and two. So this is seven and nine. Does that mean anything? Well, it means sevens are definitely down here now. Ones are somewhere along here, sevens are here. Sixes we can't tell. And twos we don't know. Uh, but we can say seven across like this and seven blocking up here. So that is where the seven must appear. And so now we know that the two and the six block this square here. Two and six are going to be in those two squares. So this is not two or six, it must be nine. Nine blocks across here, that's where the nine goes. This is a four. seven ah okay since the seven blocks down here this square must be seven and this would be a one and then one will fit there uh, now the sevens seven blocks this square here so and seven blocks this square here but also one blocks in the middle and one blocks across here so we do have a pair of one and seven in these two squares. Uh, now we know that's one and seven, so that means these two squares are two and six, which we can't get yet, but let's come back here then. So one and seven, uh, two, no, four, fours will be up here. Ah, uh, okay. Actually, now we've got... Uh, we can just do this for the moment. Four's blocking like this. Four blocking here and four blocking there. That's the position for four. Uh... Okay, so I was saying one and seven are here, right? Uh, is there anything else? We get a pair of nines in these squares, I guess. Oh, um, yeah, of course. Uh, no, uh, not of course. Take that back. <laughs> <coughs> Right, a bit more to do. See this game? Pretty good, isn't it, for a medium level?
Right, now we have eight blocking up here and eight across here. So that's where the eight goes. And this will be a seven to complete that row. Now, as we said before, seven is in one of these two squares. So obviously it can't come here now, can it? Seven must be there and one must be there. Right then, we have one blocking this square, one blocking this square, one blocking this square, and one blocking this square. So that's where the one lies. We have eight blocking this square, eight blocking this square, and eight blocking this square. So that's where the eight must go. Now, if you remember, I said two and six are in these squares here, right? We got the two and six blocking down here right like that now the missing digits oh in these three squares are two six and nine now this square here can't be two or six because two and six are going to appear here so that's got to be our nine and now we have nine blocking up here nine across here that's the location for nine nine across here and nine up there that's where the nine goes uh, four blocks across here that means four is in one of these two squares blocking down here four blocking down here that's the place for four now four blocking up here and across here that means four is in that square six blocks this square here so six appears up here and two finishes off that block down here we're looking for a six to finish the column and six blocks across here so six goes there seven is in that square there seven blocking across and down seven goes here now i know this is two and six here so this has to be our nine nine also blocks across here that's where the nine goes the last number to finish here is a two two blocks up here that's where the two is this will be uh six i guess six blocks up here and across here so six goes here there's just one digit up here to finish that row i think it's a two um okay we also have two blocking up here and two across here so two goes there uh, we have one blocking up here this is our one then last number to get here will be an eight eight blocks across here and puts an eight into that square there missing number here one oh we're down to our two and six that we worked out ages and ages ago finally we get to put them in six blocks across here so six is there and the two is the last digit for the medium level um, Guardian. No, um, sorry, New York Times medium level Sudoku puzzle. That's it. Thank you very much. Uh, back tomorrow Oh, with some Sudoku, but I am working tomorrow, so I don't know how much time I'll get. But anyway, bye-bye for now.